there guys, I be the Sample Man and welcome to Disgaea 2 Cursed Memories. In today's episode we are going to do 4-4, but off screen first I want to show you that I leveled up to level 16, to 14 to 16, and uh, you know, re-equipped a bunch of my characters, uh, got some better stuff on all of my characters. So there we go. Obviously, I'm going to do more of that off screen after this episode, but I figured let's go to Fortish 4. So let's go talk to you. Where do I want to go? I want to go to Delos River, and I want to go to the Dragon's Mouth. Taro, Hanako! To my new show. I admire your courage for coming here, suckers. You had to know this was a trap. So, if you want the brats unharmed, just hand the princess over to me. Oh, and uh, then you have to let me beat you up. <laughs> what are you talking about, Axel? Why would we do something stupid like that? Huh? What's your scheme? You're the one with the scheme. I see how you're plotting to use the princess as a hostage so you can defeat Overlord Xenon. But I will put an end to your plans. Once I've rescued the Overlord's daughter, I'll be back in the spotlight. The entire universe will witness my victory. It'll spark my glorious comeback. So, ready to fight fair? But remember, I won't be responsible for what happens to those brats if you don't let me beat you up. Then how the hell is this a fair fight? What if we refuse, huh? What if we throw you out like garbage in front of the entire universe? How will you come back from that? <laughs> <laughs> That's what my secret plan is for. Even if I lose, I can use the latest special effect technology to edit the footage. No matter how badly I lose or how much I beg for my life, I can fix it all in post. I'll have the greatest victory scene ever. <laughs> what do you know? My cunning trap had such a great twist that you're all lost for words. <laughs> nope. No, we just don't want to waste our breath. I shall grant you no mercy. Kidnapping innocent children just to get attention is unforgivable. I shall cleanse the world of you myself. Huh? Why are you so angry? I'm trying to rescue you, you know? I do not need to be rescued. I am here of my own free will. I am no one's hostage. What the hell? Aren't princesses supposed to wait for their knight in shining armor to rescue them whenever they get captured? Cough! Peek! Cough! You idiot! That only happens in your feeble imagination. <laughs> then what are we gonna do for my show? There has been a change of plans. How does series finale Axel dies rising in pain sound to you? <laughs> oh, jeez. But that's not how I want my series to end. Can I at least have a happy ending? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we're all out of happy endings today. We only have ones that end with horrible beating. Oh, jeez. Just remember, every punch is for Taro and Hanako. Oh no, you've angered the wrong guy. Taro and Hanako were too much. You just don't do that to Taro and Hanako. Okay, so obviously this map is a boss fight chapter. So there's this way, and you get all these right here. Okay. And I think, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take uh, Riku and throw her over here. I'll leave all my rest, my best players over here. Eh. There's two very destructive looking players right there. Eh, I don't want... Mm. I'll take Rosie and I'll throw her over there. That sounds like a plan. Okay. So, let's do this. We're going to get Rosie over there. And we're going to have her... Uh, 
fix that, uh, that panel over there. Alright, so there's that. Hey, look it! I can fix this panel! Ooh! There we go! It's gonna nullify that effect right there. So, obviously, I wanna try to get towards these right here and, uh, nullify all their effects, but I'm not bound to do that. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty over-leveled for this, uh, fight, so I'm not really too worried, uh, very much at all about this. So let's keep going. We want to get Lara going over this way. We have all sorts of amazing attacks that we can do and have lined up and ready and raring to go. All my, all my characters can move really far because I have equipped all of them with slippers. So they, they got an extra movement space anyway, so that's also a good thing. Alright, so let's end this turn. Alright, let's see. She's going to attack Rozzy. Oh, you, you hurt me. Oh, no. Don't hurt me too much. Here, get you on the base. And dead. You suck. Okay, so we're going to keep going this way with Rozzy. She'll, she'll bring up that side. And see, I'm not really, I really don't even care what happens. And we'll wait. I'm gonna try to get all those effects neutralized over here, so let's do this! Rozzy will have all sorts of good stuff happen. Alright, Rozzy, you need to get over there, lady. Okay, let's go. There we go. I'll just wait until Rozzy can take care of all that. Oh, you poisoned me, you bitch. Okay. Well, you're gonna die for that. Have a nice day! Okay. If worse comes worse, I'll just use a healing item on her. I'm not worried. Uh, 70 more. I got a few more turns. Okay. So, obviously, I'll just use a healing item on her. That'll be... Let's hope that I can... Ooh, yeah, okay. Mm, uh, recover HP. That's 30... 60, bleh, this is going to be bad. Alright. So, what do I want to get rid of? I want to probably get rid of the attack, the defense negative 50, so let's do that. Alright. Yeah, I'll, I'll get rid of that. I'll move my characters after that turn. Wait. Hold on, I want to get rid of... Okay, whatever. I want to get rid of the blue. I don't care about the defense plus 50 or any of that other stuff. I'm more worried about the attack negative 50. Okay, so we're going to end that. Oh, and she's... She's back being helpful. Nice. Okay, so goodbye. I'm going to destroy these as we go. You know what? I'm just gonna get rid of all of them. So that way we don't have to worry about this. Okay. Sounds like a plan to me. Anyways, it gets her some uh, tripers. I know you can throw these and uh, get a bigger chain, but I really don't care. I'm I'm just gonna destroy them to get rid of all their effects, and we'll see where we go from there. Okay. So now that that's done, let's. Get my characters moving. Okay, it's a fair fight. Hi, buddy. How you doing? I hope you're doing good because you're going to get shot in the face as well as getting punched in the face. <laughs> Die. And getting shot. Boom. Okay, not worried. Should have moved uh, you. And yeah, whatever. Doesn't matter. I can just slowly move you. It doesn't matter to me. One way or another. Okay. So we'll just keep this going. We'll move my mages just in a in a way that they're not going to get injured. Hopefully. Okay. So there we go. We'll see what happens here. 
Okay. Bow user coming up that way. Okay. Still not worried too much. Okay, this idiot needs to die. That is going to happen. Goodbye, my friend. Have a nice life. Perfect. Okay. So, what did you think you had to accomplish doing this? I hope you didn't think you were going to win, because I'm going to slice your hair off. Haha. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Easy peasy. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. And it's going to be freaking hilarious. Okay. Hi. Get shot in the face. And your speed's down even more. Ha. <laughs> oh, yes. Okay. Actually, I don't want to move them too far up. Because that would be a bad thing. Okay, can I hit her from here? I'm I'm saying yes I can. Time to die, bitch! Oh my god, yes. That that fire magic, man. It's way too powerful. Way too powerful. It's not even fair. Ah, oh, it's fair. I, I I call it fair. Whatever. Okay, let's move you up here. Maybe we can get some ice magic on. Yep, I can. Hi, buddy. Get iced. Okay, there we go. Yeah, let's see if we can uh, get Rozzy around here. I don't think she can. Yep, she can't make it. She's stuck over here. She's stuck. Oh, God. Okay, so, Rozzy, you're stuck over there. Have a nice day. Okay, we're in good shape. I have a bunch of magicians. They have a bunch of... You don't want to live, do, do you? You don't want to live, do you? I can, I can end you right now. In fact, I am going to end you just for doing that. Goodbye. All right, move her back. No worries. No worries. You know what? I'm going to kill your friend over here. Just because I don't like her over here. Oh, you're done to stay alive, are you? Well, not for long, my friend. Not for long. Goodbye. You're still alive? Well, you won't be. I will, I will destroy you. Okay. Oh, okay. That that works. Take that. Take that, you freak. Okay. Hmm. I think it's time to hurricane slash you. Hi, buddy. How's it going? Prince of Harlequin would like to uh rip your legs off. Ha 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 ha. Ah, yes. See, I'm not worried in the slightest. I'm not worried in the slightest. See, I, I'm in the, I have this ability to just destroy you guys easily. There's nothing you can do about it either. Nothing, nothing. <laughs> oh yes. All right. So now, just for shits and giggles, we'll mega heal you. And there we go. That was easy. Enter. Bring it. Oh no, not the zero damage. Oh, not the zero damage again. <laughs> oh, you. Okay. So, hmm. I think we'll get turn ups a kill. Because Turnips hasn't gotten a kill in this You know what? I can go over here and shoot you in the face. You know why? Because I can do it. Take this. Alright. I'm not even worried. I'm not worried about you guys. Not worried. Hi. How you doing? I'm gonna impale you now. Die! Okay. Get your... Get your scrawny ass out here. I have some killing to do. All right, there we go. Now we'll we'll bring our uh, good old 
magicians out here. And we're going to uh, make his life a miserable hell. <laughs> okay. You know what? We'll wait. I'm not even worried. I don't care. Bring it. Ooh, don't hurt me. And punch. And punch. Oh. Okay. Now I'll go over here and SWAR you. Okay. SWAR. Okay, that's not gonna work if you're way too far away. So we'll SWAR you there, Riku. Okay. Now to now to end you. It's over for you. I hope you had your last supper. Die! There we go. Perfect. Now, sir, what did you think you were doing? Did you think you were doing something? Because, yeah. Not, not happening. Okay, we're gonna move you out of the way. And we'll bring, uh, we'll bring Laharl over here. Hi. I'd like to, uh, I'd like to just say, it's been nice knowing you. <laughs> ah! Oh, man. The evil laughter, man. The evil laughter. Hi, buddy. Time to get lions roared. And explosion. And see, that's not even, that's not even my strongest attack. Hi, I have some wind magic I'd like to use. So, uh, yeah. Time to get winded and missed. God damn it, you're not supposed to miss. Okay. Fire magic on him. There you go. That's more like it. Okay. Can I can use ice magic on you. No, I don't want to use Adele. There we go. On Axel, even though that will probably miss. Oh, I got a hit on him. Even better. Okay. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. No matter. Get punched. Okay. Still not worried. Hmm. You know what I'll do? I'm gonna lift you. I'm gonna throw you here. Okay. So now, what I want to do. Hmm. I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use an impaler really fast. And then we'll use a hurricane slash by uh, Laharl. That sounds like a plan. Okay. Hi, buddy. I'm going to use a hurricane slash. I hope you don't mind. And. Ooh. Ooh. That kind of hurt, didn't it? A level up. Heck yeah, man. All right. So that was easy. No, I don't want to skip the story. What the hell sort of shit is that? was brainwashed by a secret society and only I can free her from the vicious tigress they turned her into <laughs> a tigress eh are you still making stuff up get over it already <laughs> you can't fool me you probably use some futuristic device on her like when you mutilate cattle what <laughs> kicked them in the ass Oh jeez! Oh no, Taro! No! What have I done? You fool! You're a fool! 
You foolishly foolhardy fool face! Fool! It's time for the news! Today we're focusing on the latest netherworld hotspot, the countryside world, Veldheim. The land is rich with nature's beauty. Among the attractions is the Dallas River, which flows throughout the major continent. We go there live via satellite with our field reporter, Sammy. This is Sammy reporting live from Veldheim. Although the river looks calm, the currents are fast. Children can easily be swept away. It's the Super Bowl Shark! <laughs> from my location, the river flows into the Cavern of Evil, a dangerous cave from which no one has ever returned alive. Watching people drown in the river is the most fun you can find for free in Veldheim. That's all from Veldheim. Back to you in the studio. Thanks, Sammy. For a second there, I thought I saw Axel in the background. But he was savagely murdered by tribesmen. <laughs> <laughs> it must have been an impersonator. Axel impersonators? The universe is going to hell. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, for the ever popular decapitating fortune telling with Pram the Oracle right after this commercial break. This broadcast was delayed by 40 minutes due to the Netherworld baseball classic game going into extra innings. A baseball game. <laughs> Now, you know Axel is dead. They even said so on the news. And that prank call we got earlier? Where do people get it in their heads to further depress a mother who lost her son? But that really looked like Big Brother. Save the file? Yes, siri Bob. Okay, so let's quickly save. And we will continue the story a little bit more. And, uh, look for some treasure chests as well. Mmm, yes. Alright, so, now loading screen is now loading. Heck yeah, man. Alright, let's do this. Let us do this. Oh, jeez! Instant replay again! No! No, Taro! Swim, buddy! Swim! Go for it! Doggy pedal faster! No! No! What have I done? That's too bad. The river flows right into the cavern of evil. If he falls in there, we'll never see Taro again. Someone do something. Come to think of it, he was a nice kid. May his soul rest in peace. Idiot. Taro is my servant. I won't lose a servant to this stupid river. Fine. Pretend he's your servant if it helps. But we have to save him now. Let's go. Adele, wait! I'm going with you! No, wait right here. We might have to go into the cavern to save him. Then you'll need me even more. I'll show you how useful I am. Adele, there's no time to argue. Didn't you say we have to save him now? Oh, Okay, fine. But you better listen to me, okay, Hanako? <laughs> okay. Hanako has forced her way into your group. Oh, man. And there we go, walking very slowly away. And there's Hanako. <laughs> Thanks to Tardo's clumsiness, I got to join Adele's group. Now I'll always be at Adele's side. Thank you, Taro. I owe you big. What are you waiting for, Hanako? Oh jeez, she's running over there, oh my! This wasn't supposed to happen! I, I, I just wanted to... You're an idiot! Episode 5, The Promise. And The Promise is where we will end this episode. Oh man, we got some treasure chests to look for. Dear oh. God, please protect Taro and Hanako. 
Why is a demon praying to God? Besides, Adele is there to protect them. I guess you're right, honey. Adele can protect them. While you were out praying, have you remembered anything about Adele's parents? Um, no, I don't remember anything about them. Mm, me neither. But I do vaguely remember their faces. Uh-oh. Huh. Hmm. Interesting. All right. So we have a few treasure chests to go looking for. And we'll start over here like we always do. And look around. Oh, hello. There's one. Boxing gloves. All right. So let's see if I can see any others. Okay. None there. None there. None there. Okay. None there. Okay. Is there any on top of this house? It doesn't look like there is, but there is one right there. 1,500 health. Heck yeah, man. All right, so I definitely want to look around. You don't want to, you know, just miss out on everything. You know, it's, it's very easy to miss treasure chests in this game. All right, nothing here. Nope. All right, anything around here? Nope. Okay, so it's got to be around the house or on top of the house. Nope, it's right here. Another 1,500 hell. Okay, so next episode, we are going to start Chapter 5. See you guys next time for some more fun in action with me, the Sample Man. Peace.